What's going on gamers? Today we'll be going over how to use magma with your Minecraft server. Before we get started, don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring the notification bell in order to stay updated on all of our Minecraft videos. Combining mods and plugins on the same Minecraft server has been a highly wanted feature since the very advent of both, but this has always been hard to implement. Mods and plugins are designed with different paradigms in mind. While mods add new gameplay to the server and require matching mod lists on both the server and every computer joining, plugins only change small portions of gameplay, making them far lighter to develop and deploy onto vanilla servers. Because of this, plugin loaders and mod loaders are traditionally not made with compatibility in mind. However, there's recently been a development. Magma has come out promising to rid us once and for all of this pesky limitation. Magma is a hybrid server software built on top of Forge, which is a mod loader, and Paper, which is a plugin loader, bridging the gap between the two and allowing both mods and plugins to be installed onto the same server at the same time without having to use any cumbersome workarounds. With Magma, it's as easy as drag and dropping files into the correct folders. Magma is still heavily in development, so compatibility is limited, unfortunately. The current version only supports Minecraft 1.12.2, but higher versions are being worked on, so the list of compatible versions is sure to expand in the future. Today we'll be going over the steps on installing Magma onto your Apex server. First, head to your Apex server's control panel. From there, scroll down and locate the jar field. And under the drop down list, scroll to find Magma 1.12.2. For the first prompt, select Change Version. For the second prompt, click Create a New World, as the effects won't take place unless you click that option. From there, press Restart Now when it prompts you. And that's all there is to it. Any mods, plugins you have previously wanted will transfer over to Magma and you can proceed with adding any new ones that you might want. Once Magma is up and running, you can add plugins and mods the same way that you would with Forge or Bucket or Spigot or Paper. We have handy guides on showing you how to do both of these things. Both of those links will be down in the description below. Staying up to date with the latest news in Minecraft server administration tools is useful for everyone, professional server owners, and those playing for fun. Enriching you and your player's experience is an unending task, and Magma is a perfect way to spruce things up and add new features without sacrificing anything. And that will do it for this video. And as always, I hope that you have lots of fun. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more great content like this, then subscribe or click these videos. Until next time, gamers.